There's been a lot of talk about, is there a second bubble? Are we going to see a second bubble? Well, here's my thought. Before you can have a second bubble, you have to have a first bubble. We didn't have that here, if you didn't remember. Now, certainly, did they have it in different places? Oh, yeah. You look at California. You look at Arizona. You look at most of Florida. Folks, when they were enjoying 20, 30, 40, in Arizona's case, 50% appreciation in one year, a home going from $500,000 to seven fifty dollars in one year, it's just not, you can't sustain that. It can't continue on. So those markets had significant price adjustments. The bubble, if you will, burst. But here in Denver, <coughs> what I wouldn't give them for a week of that. And two weeks of that would have been great. We just didn't have it. We've had a slow, sustainable marketplace here, historically, for a long, long time. And that really, what it tells us is, well, we don't have much of a fear of a big bubble bursting because we've just been <coughs> trucking along consistently. And there is, it's not sexy, it's not glamorous, but let me tell you, it has positioned us very well for the marketplace we're in right now, clearly illustrating our ability to move out of this quicker than most places.